Hello editors, welcome back to Magic Cube Edits. It's great to have you here. If you've been struggling to download CapCut PC and also facing exporting problems, and you've been searching for a solution for a while, then your search ends right here. Because today's video is very special. I'm going to show you exactly how to download and export videos in CapCut PC without any issues. No region blocks, no export errors, just a smooth and easy workflow. And if you want to make stunning videos like me, अब 10 ग्लास बचे हैं और 11 लोग खड़े हैं। अगर हर कोई एक या दो सही ग्लास चुनते हैं, तो हम सही सलामत पार कर जाएंगे और शायद ना भी कर पाए। अगर आगे वाले लोग डर जाएं और टाइम पर बात करने लगे, इससे हम पर खतरा बढ़ जाएगा। सुनो मादर चोदो मैं आगे नहीं जाऊंगा अगर तुम जाना चाहते हो तो जाओ देन मेक श्योर यू वॉच दिस वीडियो टिल द एंड लेट्स गेट स्ट्रेट इनटू इट स्टेप 1 चेंज रीजन टू अल्जीरिया फर्स्ट ओपन योर पीसी सेटिंग्स देन गो टू टाइम एंड लैंग्वेज देन क्लिक ऑन लैंग्वेज एंड रीजन नाउ स्क्रॉल डाउन एंड चेंज योर रीजन टू अल्जीरिया दिस इज इंपॉर्टेंट CapCut is only available in certain regions, and if we change region to Algeria, so we download CapCut easily. Step two, downloading CapCut. Now open the Microsoft Store, search for CapCut and click install. Wait for it to download completely. I have already downloaded that, so move to the next step. Step three, install and connect XVPN. Next, search for XVPN in the Microsoft Store and install that too. Once installed, open XVPN and connect it. This helps CapCut work smoothly without region errors or crashes. Step 4. Open CapCut and edit your video. Open CapCut, start your project, and edit your video like you normally do. For an example, this time I will open a project and add some pro effects. Here you see, this is a pro effect that I have used. When your edit is ready, if you click on export, then it's show to join pro. Here's the game start. For exporting the video, follow the next steps very carefully. Step 5. Render timeline for export the video. For rendering the video, right-click on timeline, then go on render, and click on whole timeline. After that, you see the rendering process on top of the video player. And the rendering time is depending on your PC. This may take some time. After completing this process, move forward to next step. Step 6. Compound clip and pre-render. Now press Ctrl plus A to select all your clips. Then right-click on a selected clip and create a compound clip. After that, right-click again on the compound clip and click on Pre-Process Compound Clip. Then again, to see top of the video player, it's Show Applying One Future. This will be take about two to five minutes. After completing that, follow the next step. Step seven, find the exported video in File Manager. Press Windows key, plus R, type, app data, and hit enter. Navigate to local, cap cut, user data, projects, com.lvdeter.draft. Find your project folder. Don't know your project name? Just open cap cut and click anywhere in the timeline. Not on a layer, you'll see your project name at the top. Now go to that folder in File Manager, then open Resources, Combinations. You'll see many video file. Look for the one that ends with underscored video. That's your final rendered video. Drag that file back into CapCut, then drag it again and drop it on top of your compound clip in the timeline. A dialog box will pop up. Click Replace Clip. Now click on Export and see there is no Join Pro option. Here you can set the name of the file, export location, video resolution, bitrate, 
video FPS. And that's it. That's how you download CapCut on your PC, use a VPN to make it work, and export your videos for free without any issues, step by step. If this video helped you, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to Magic Cube Edits for more editing tutorials, CapCut tricks, and YouTube growth tips. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.